fantastic event. It's really cool to see who all the surprise uh, performers are. It's like family in the room. So it's, yes, you've got some amazing celebrity power, but everybody's here as friends uh, to enjoy and celebrate music. Uh, and it's a cool vibe, what can I say? I finally got important enough that I got invited to Clive Davis' party. Clive and I were at Columbia Records for over 50 years together. All the performances. Um, yeah, I really can't wait. I can't wait to see Sam Smith. I'm such a big fan. I'm just excited to see all the celebrities. I'm just yeah. going to be like looking around all nervous the whole time. It'll be fun. This is a, the hottest ticket in town, for sure. Clive is a legend, and anything he does is just unbeatable. So. Um, this is the one that I think everybody waits for. If he hadn't signed us, we might not have been here today. Thank you very exactly. much. In fact, yes. he gave us our first big break. Clive is just one of the mainstays of the music world, and um, we all come out and pay homage to him on this night. The night of the Grammys, or the day of the Grammys, everyone's tense, you know, so many performers are performing, and no one has time to have fun until after. So tonight you have fun, you share, you know, with all your peers, your talent, you have a good time. Oh, it's a dress-up party, and there's good music, and let's not, you know, it's a light. People are screaming just because of Taylor Swift's dress. I mean, they'll, they'll sing for her music, she'll shake it off, but they'll also just scream for her dress, and that's what I love about the Grammys. Clive knows everybody, everybody knows Clive. I mean, it's like the event. Artie Bandier is uh, one of the finest and iconic music publishers uh, of the decade, and I've known him a long time. It's the first year we've actually honored a music publisher, and the bottom line is, uh, as they say, it all begins with a song. Marty has been a champion for music. He's always loved the music, loved the songs, loved the songwriters, and that's why I'm here tonight. He's been our champion all these years. I think it's like a vindication for songwriters. This is the year of songwriters, and I think it's the first time a, a music publisher has ever been honored like this, and um, uh, never before have songwriters been under such stress as a result of change in the manner in which music is accessed, listened to, and paid for. So, it, it, for me, it's like a, a, a crowning achievement, but at the same time, it's really all about the songwriters.